everyone. Um, we are here today to do a tutorial. Um, this was suggested by a subscriber. And so I picked to do a look on Felicia for to look like Numi Rapaz from the girl with the dragon tattoo, the Swedish version. Um, so if you are interested in seeing more of that, <laughs> good luck to you. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> um, and this is what it looks like. So if you want to see how I did this, keep watching. It's like this. Whoa. I can't, it's hard for me to see. Okay, there, there we go. go. My finger's in the way. Sorry about that. And I am using... You might have to speak up. I'm using B20 on you. That's beige. I don't really know how much to use here, but we're just going to start out like that. What kind of brush are you using? I'm using a Real Techniques stippling brush. Do you start... Never mind, I can't ask you that. I would tap it and then, and then like spread it around because you just put a whole lot on there. Sorry. Okay, now we're going to use the Laura Mercier Secret Camouflage, which Felicia made me get like that and it's SC2. So I'm trying not to get into the habit of sticking my fingers in, in the makeup because eventually, you know, I just want it to be a good habit. Yeah. Okay, so next we are, we are going to do Felicia's eyebrows and I'm going to just brush through them a little bit first. I'm using this e.l.f. eyebrow kit, like that, and it's in medium. He wants in. No, she's not allowed in here anymore. And first I'm going to use, this is pretty cool, this sleek makeup, what is this called? Primer palette. Looks like that. Looks like that in there. A concealer brush. And I'm going to use this color right here. This brown right there. And I'm just going to put this, I'm not going to put it in the inner corner. Um, because the look that I am basing this off of, the inner corners of her eyes in here are really, they look really like vanilla-y. So, <laughs> you're, you're going to laugh at me. They're all gonna laugh at you. <laughs> They're gonna laugh at you. So I'm just gonna put it like kind of in the middle here. I would say like two thirds over. This goes on way later than I thought it would. Yeah, you gotta pack. I like this brush. I'm going to use this NYX Milk. Just in this like inner corner part over here. It's a contour brush. So, so I'm going to use these in the matte. It's really zoomed in right now. Yeah. So I'm going to use um, probably these two or maybe these two or a combination of that. Ooh, that's pretty and dark. So I'm just going to pack it on here. And if I don't like it, I'll just take it off with a baby wipe. <laughs> I'm going to take it right underneath here. I'm going to use that same color. This is the color I'm using, by the way. This is the color I decided on. It's really pretty. So that's all I'm going to use for right now. I'm going to use... It's kind of hard to show. Uh, that one and probably that a little bit because I want the inner corner to look really light but like vanilla and I think I'm going to I kind of skipped a step can you open your eyes please okay I guess I should blend this other stuff first and to do that I am going to use this brush it is a Sonia Kashuk brush. Okay. I'm gonna 
that's kind of nice. Oh, that's nice, that little combination I just threw together. I'm going to show them what that was. So here I just took this color and a little tiny bit of that color because it looks a little peachy. And then from the shimmer palette, I used that one. This has a little bit of shimmer to it. So wait, no, we're going to do this liner first. We're only going to do liner on the top. Um, and we're going to use this Annabelle Smudge Liner in Rich Chocolate. We didn't even use the purple. I didn't, I don't want to, I changed my mind about that. It feels nice like I did it on my hand and it was kind of nice. Like it seems like it goes on pretty easily. Ulta Amped Lash Mascara, the waterproof kind, in black brown. Looks like this. Can't really get it in the store anymore. <laughs> And now we're going to put this blush on, the Makeup Academy one. So the last thing I'm going to do is Felicia's lips. And in the picture she has like a very pinky kind of lip. So we are going to use this CoverGirl Outlast Smoothwear and it's in Berry. And now we're going to use this, you know, Felicia and her sale items. This number seven lip gloss in Jelly Bean. Looks like that. That's really pink. This is the finished look that I did on Felicia. Who is it again? Numi Rapace. From what? From the Girl with the Dragon Tattoo, the Swedish version. The Swedish version. Mm hmm it's I wish I could hold the picture up. It's from a magazine. Yeah. L. It's from the Norwegian. No, the Norwegian, Norwegian L. L. If you just look up, it's N-O-R-G-E-L magazine and type in new me and you will find that. I think that Felicia looks a lot like her, so I wanted to, when a subscriber suggested that we do each other's makeup, um, I was like, I'm going to pick new me repost because I think that Felicia looks like her. So I'm going to do Sarah's makeup next week, but I can't remember who she wants me to do. It's a Kate Winslet look. Kate Winslet. Oh, yeah, it's a really pretty black, glossy eye. It's yeah. definitely an editorial look. It's not something that you would probably walk around with. Um, well, I mean, maybe for going out at night, but it it's, cool, it's so. definitely a nighttime look, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. So, So that's Felicia's look. This is Sarah's first attempt at doing somebody's makeup. Yeah. And we're going to keep going. We'll do these like once a month. We could do this once a month. It would be fun, right? No? Mm -hmm. She's so funny. All I'll right. I'll try it. I'm going to wear a hat in every video just to make Felicia mad. I don't care. Hey, man, if I didn't have to wear this, I wouldn't. But All right, so we're going to end this now. I have tons of editing to do. Thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> thanks, for, <laughs> thanks for struggling through that with me. <laughs> All right, everybody. See you later. Bye. Bye.